So I want them to remember me as a humble lady that worked hard from the heart for the environment throughout my year. And I'm sure a lot of people have seen that. It's not a matter of saying, it's a matter of actually seeing the results of all the work that I've done. Well, I am very excited for what's coming up next. Um, I really have a lot of projects in mind here in the Philippines. I plan to stay here and uh, of course, uh, if possible, be able to continue with my studies as well because I am already a lawyer. So if maybe I can take up a master's here, I would love to if there's enough time. But also when it comes to projects, I have a few in mind that I want to start with. So I really hope that everything comes true like I want it. How about modeling and um, show business? Well, here in the Philippines, if I have a chance to continue with, uh, you know, with the world of entertainment and fashion and all that, in if I have a possibility, I will definitely join in my spare time because honestly, my intentions here is to really I have my own business and and start up with new projects. It pretty much is that. But of course, I'm very open to any other activities. I've had um, opportunities throughout the year to travel, but uh, I will have to mention that being Miss Earth when I went to Reunion Islands to crown their, their queen, as well as Angola. In Africa, I was also in the United States, in Puerto Rico, Chile, and of course back in Ecuador to turn over the crown to the next representative. The things that I did there in every country, uh, well, I will usually stay there for four or five days and involved in the environmental activities that they will have prepared for me. Uh, maybe a, a campaign, trash bin, or even school tours, visiting the schools with the kids. Uh, we will have a lot of activities that every country had on their own initiative. So I will be involved in that. And as well, I will be judging uh, the pageant and crowning the next representative. We will do a lot of um, planting trees in different places and pretty much it was environmental activities. You did a lot of traveling around the Philippines also. Oh yes, a lot. Honestly, Isabella has opened up doors for me so so much and I was able to go around many of the, of the cities there. It's really one of my favorite provinces as well as Davao. Davao, I love it because I my fans there are amazing. I have a lot of great friends for, for a lifetime. And also the last province I was able to visit um, which was Palawan, El Nido. So I was able to really enjoy the beauty of the islands of the Philippines because before I was, I, I've never been there. So I went there and explored a little bit of it and you guys are really blessed with such enchanted islands. It's amazing. How do you want uh, people to remember you by? I want people to remember me as um, a woman that has been very hardworking and uh, no matter what people will say about me, I will always be very positive every day. I want them to remember me as a very brave and courageous woman that every day had a smile to give to anyone. You know, I want them to somehow get inspired by the fact that no matter what we can having our lives even if you have so many problems there's always a way to get throughout them with a smile and actually and if people don't value you you have to learn to value yourself and love yourself so i want them to remember me as a humble lady that worked hard from the heart for the environment throughout my year and i'm sure a lot of people have seen that it's not a matter of saying, it's a matter of actually seeing the results of all the work that I've done.